Hello everyone. So today I've decided to make a few changes to a bag I made around a month or two ago from sisal thread I bought at a market. So I used two hangers and created a rectangular frame that creates the frame of the bag. So I didn't actually like the outcome of the top of the bag. It was very bulky as you'll see here. So I decided to undo that part and find a new design. I did have an idea of the design that I wanted to create, but I had already used almost all of the sisal strings, so I had very few remaining. I knew I wanted a minimal design, and so what I did was use the available thread that was hanging from the bag at the front. Then using those strings, I created an overlapping pattern and ended up sewing those strings together. I did have to add some extra string so that I could fill up those spaces that would otherwise be visible. This being my first time actually making a bag and also using the sisal string, it was pretty hard and really hard on my hands, um, but I'm proud that I can say I actually have made a bag from sisal string. <laughs> there are lots of things I could do different next time. Maybe even avoid the hangers and not actually frame the bag using the hangers but frame it using just the sisal and you know create corners that are free and flexible. But I do love the bag. I love the experience working on it. And I had a good time and it's a good bag. Well, kinda. <laughs> so jokes aside, um, I did have a good time making this bag. It did take a while, but I did finish, so the fact that I tried, I count that as success. So thanks for watching. Bye.